Um, my name is uh, Professor Hassan Diab. Uh, I'm a professor of computer engineering at the American University of Beirut. I'm currently vice president at AUB, and I'm a former minister of education and higher education. Well, uh, there's no doubt that the solution is uh, multifaceted, but uh, I believe that uh, one of the uh, main uh, uh, solutions, uh, uh, which is more of a long term, is uh, in education, uh, because um, we are dealing with uh, basically ignorance that uh, is uh, spreading uh, across the world. Extremism has uh, has no. Um, uh, specific nationality or uh, religion. An extremist is an extremist, whether he is Muslim or Christian or uh, uh, from any nationality. And we've seen recently uh, the, the problems that Europe has faced, uh, some of which were, uh, uh, you know, the, the culprits uh, were either Christians or Muslims. So uh, there is uh, Islam is uh, a religion that is inclusive of uh, everybody. Uh, when we talk about uh, extremism, this is not really Islam. It's uh, something that uh, is very far from uh, Islam. So education, I think, is uh, the solution. And my uh, presentation, my keynote presentation uh, this afternoon will address this issue and how uh, curricula can play a very important role in uh, uh, graduating, uh, I'm talking about school, and graduating uh, global citizens that are open-minded, that are accepting of the other, uh, without affecting their uh, own beliefs, uh, whether it is religious or otherwise, uh, without affecting their own uh, nationalistic uh, feeling, uh, but at the same time to be open-minded to uh, humanity uh, as a whole. I think unity is extremely important, not just among Muslims, but uh, among humanity uh, in general. Uh, Lebanon is, uh, uh, if you remember, John Pope, uh, Pope uh, John Paul II, who visited uh, Lebanon many years ago, uh, said, and I'm quoting, Lebanon is not only a country, it is a message. And indeed, it's a message to the world, because the social mosaic that is uh, uh, present in Lebanon is not really in any other country. It's, a, it's an opportunity for uh, the whole world to succeed. If Lebanon succeeds in its uh, current makeup, it's a success story for humanity, not just for Lebanon. So uh, the uh, title of uh, this institute uh, and uh, uh, what this conference is addressing today on soft diplomacy, specifically in the Middle East and in the Arab world, is extremely important and uh, it is uh, uh, one way to uh, tell the world that uh, the extremism that is taking place now in the Middle East, maybe later across the world, it does not represent Islam, uh, nor uh, does it represent even humanity. I think uh, uh, through education we can make uh, a big difference. Uh, the only problem is that uh, it takes time because we're talking about uh, curricula that spreads 12 years in, uh, from grade 1 to grade 12 uh, in the K to 12. and. Uh, 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 at some point, uh, these students have to uh, be able to uh, be accepted in any university across the world. So it's important, it's extremely important uh, for uh, graduates uh, to be, as the name of my uh, uh, speech today will be, uh, global citizens.